Hey, Two Geek Crew. I'm here in a special secret location talking to Mr. Nicholas Mayfield. Yes, We're yes. not going to say where we're at. Yes. But we are at your studio. That we are. That we are. If you guys don't know Nicholas Mayfield stuff, it's just really, I say really awesome, straight to the point, punch you. Thank hits you. you in the gut, but it's beautiful to look at. Thank you. That's that's the goal of it. Um, I've been I've been painting. I've been painting as my first friend since I was five years old. Okay. So it just makes more sense, especially as an adult, of me doing this mm -hmm. for the fruition of just seeing your mind and fruition, and also for my daughter, for my the seas to come to see that to make a living off what you're happy about, mm -hmm. it doesn't exist. It's an American dream. It's the truth of it. And uh, I've been blessed. I've been blessed. So I'm just running with it. Yeah, man. Just run with it until, yeah. until you can't run. Hey, man. Yeah. And even then, man, I'm getting on my brother's backs, man. We got to go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. But real quick, if most people don't know, is he doesn't just paint on canvas. You paint on everything. Yeah, I paint on uh, furniture to cars, dogs, uh, if I anything moving. Yeah. If it comes to tires, you name it. I've seen your stuff. I mean, you have... Appreciate it. Uh, girls in bikinis. Yes, I do. Um, at the show, you had wallets, umbrellas, Body hats. Paint. Yeah. yeah, it was everywhere. Yeah, I, 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 would, I would prefer the whole world to be colored in, yeah. in, in my art. It's happier. Yeah. yeah. It yeah. is. It it's brings a, smiles. A, yeah, it should yeah. bring. And even when it comes to like even the body paint and even the girls on bikinis, yeah. I don't want to look all fleshy and just like the pervert yeah. that is as <laughs> that is on the girl. Like, look at it. Yeah. I want it to be an art piece that the at least the the woman can show her kid. Like that's a dope art piece, mm -hmm. and she's a woman still and catch that circa. You know. What I mean? Yeah, you know what? And when I saw those photos, it wasn't like oh, a cute girl in a bikini. Exactly. It was like. That's pretty awesome how you painted it. It looks really good, and it's like, oh, then there's a cute girl in it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, was... I, I want to be more of the scenery than the girl. Like, yeah. you know, no diss, but it ain't about you. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, real quick, man, we have some awesome paintings back here behind us. Um, if we should we talk about them a little bit. Yeah, I just finished this one uh, yesterday. I did these two yesterday, okay. and um, I did this one, uh, the cheetah, on millennial relationships because. <laughs> That's that's what it's become. I, I look at like the baby boomers. I look at like Generation X to us, and there is a shift of the work ethic, the how long it takes, the patience, what love really is. There's so many options nowadays, exactly. and there's so many. You don't have to be. You don't have to have a breakthrough. You can skip and escape, escape, and everything's about me, me, me instead of what it takes to make one. So. Uh, I thought millennial relationships with a cheetah was probably uh, teardrops was probably the best for for it. For it yeah, it's I mean, it's really nice, dude. I, like I said, the, the colors pop. Is your I, hand tired? No, it's it's fine. I'm okay. used to this. All right. yeah, dude, I'm I'm good. Like, mm. don't worry about me. All right, all right. Yeah. cool, cool. <laughs> and then we, real quick, we have this one too. Our leader. Yeah, our, our leader is right here. Uh, I did also uh, the fact of like it seems like. To be an to be an American um, to be American leader, the team is never the whole team of the United States is not going to be on your side. The fact of a lion, I chose the fact that a lion has to do everything from a cub, especially as a male, to start his own, and you really rarely even appreciate it. I feel like we don't even appreciate that anymore. It's more the sacrifice of them and. You admire, but yet you want to see it fall. It's, be, it's become yeah. our culture. So you get like our brave lion to our lion puppet. So, you know, it's just like that. That's pretty much what it is. And you always will have their eyes on the green. That's what they will have as an excuse, you know. So, yeah. I, you know what? I didn't even know his eyes were green until I saw it. You pointed out right now. Message. Yeah, I know. What's, what's that movie? Um. Don't don't be a menace. In South Central, We're, I drink your juice in the head. Yeah, what is, every time you see uh, the oldest Wayne message, message, <laughs> Keenan man. Yeah. Boys in the Hood was ten times better. Oh yeah, oh, hands yeah. down, hands down. That's the one that matters. Yeah, that's the one that matters. But you gotta appreciate the little By little far. comedy one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. the little poppins. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Real quick, we're gonna get a good picture of this, but we want to talk about this one. This one I saw when I saw it on the gram. I immediately loved it. Thank you. Yeah, dude, the message is awesome on that one. Uh, stop giving me money. Heaven doesn't work that way. 
are, are like that. Yeah, by far. Um, when it comes to Christianity, especially in America, uh, we have broken it down. We forget about the Constantine breakdown from the slavery mindset. Um, it's been broken down to pretty much it's left the spirit of God. It's been now it's more tradition and pretty much straight up. It's like a, a synagogue way of the Sabbath instead of actually the message that Jesus is trying to tell you. Like, yo, I'm 33. I'm running with goons. <laughs> the law is after me. I understand, guys. You guys need some food all the time. But it's not me. It's the spirit in me. And you need that, too. That's what you got in you now. So, yeah, I did it more on the fact of, like, he doesn't need your damn money. He need, he needs the willingness and action. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Even if even the fact that Jesus says that he wants the willing, even willing without action is a fantasy. And there needs to be the must receive with harvest and work, the the love of work, of it. So I did that, and I did dogs at the bottom to be yeah. like, all dogs go to heaven also because they have souls. We become yeah. that. Yeah. We become that. Like ah, oh, they don't have soul. Everything. Yeah. We're all one. You know what I mean? The one love. Yeah, I'm with you on that one, man. Yeah. I, I do believe my dog has a soul. And and they're I feel, better than humans, <laughs> man. And I feel bad when they always give me that judgy eye, like, oh ah, I know what you do. Oh, my gosh. They're better than humans. Uh, especially when I come home at 2 o'clock in the yeah. morning, and they're like, yeah, we know you've been drinking. Have you, have you, yeah. have you had a, you've had a crappy day, and you've yeah. come home to your lady before, haven't you? Yeah. And you know when you come home, you got to have it back in your mind, like, man, I pray to God yeah. that she's in a good vibe, and I can have me this, like, uh, a non-believable like babe I made some yeah. food are you okay I'm gonna have some water for you just wanna make sure I rub your feet you're not gonna get that that's never happens but you pay for it so yeah. then it's a situation that you come to like an actual dog You the dog could be starving uh, bait is happy tail wagging yeah yeah and yeah. you can't find that nowhere else man sure. cats don't get shit no, yeah they don't you know what yeah. I mean dogs dogs we made yeah. them and, and they love us yeah my yeah. dog like I could just Go to the po to the uh, the mailbox in front of my house. Yeah. and will like miss me. And that's, that's what I'm part. saying. That's the best part. They uh, want you to leave. Humans yeah. want you to leave. Yeah. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean. Like while you're out there, go get some milk. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And do something for yeah. me by it. Yeah. Dogs want a lot too. They want to be pet all the time. I, I found I, out the secret. Yeah. I don't think they love me. I think they just like to get pet, pet a lot. But I'll keep that inside. Yeah. <laughs> uh, real quick too. Uh, you have a couch. Yeah, boom. Dog, dogs painted all over it. You want to pan over real quick? Yeah, the new one I'm working on uh, for the Santa Barbara Art Show. Uh -huh. that, oh. That's going to be on the 5th through the 8th at the Egg uh, Gallery. Um, this this is a couch that I'm working on. Mm -hmm. It's pretty much it's going to be uh, the variety of just Dobermans, uh, the chocolate to just even like the, the white fawn shepherd to uh, the basic. But I'm thinking about right now, I'm going to put, I want to add more colors, so I'm going to add more collars and maybe even teardrops to it. But furniture is just really where I'm going at right now. Ah, man. Uh, you know, we got this chair right here. Oh, yeah. These piano keys. Yeah, man. Yeah. Little, oh. little guy. It's going to be also for the, um, the Santa, Santa Barbara, Barbara show. show. Yeah, Santa Barbara show. Uh, you know, my favorite uh, jazz artist is Delonious Monk. Okay. We have the same birthday, actually. Nice. And um, I kind of dedicate that to him. Nice. Right. And real quick, yeah. Santa, uh, since you brought it up, you have a show at Santa Barbara? Yeah, I got a show uh, in October. Uh, my October schedule thus far is uh, 5th to the 8th. Okay. We're going to be at uh, Egg Gallery. Okay. And uh, Santa Barbara is going to be, I'm pretty, st I'm very stoked about this. Yeah. It's going to be crazy. And then after that, um, we have Trap Art on the 8th. Okay. And then uh, we have Joe Too Cool, uh, my collaboration with him, which I'm so stoked about it. Like, Mr. Doggy Style himself. Yeah. And uh, going to do that in November. And then after that, we gear up for our uh, our tour for the, for 2018. Yeah. And you told us you did a world tour. Yeah, yeah we're going to do a world tour. Yeah. yeah. Was the world for the 2D crew out there, where can we find you at? Uh, we're going to start off in Los Angeles. From Los Angeles, we're going to go pretty much to Atlanta direction. So that there is your New Mexico, there's Arizona, uh -huh. there's all that. Texas, so forth, uh, Austin, Houston. And then after that, we're going to head to Atlanta. And then from Atlanta, we're pretty much going up from Florida, Jersey, all the way up to New York. Okay. We're going to take a break. And then after that, we're going to hit the Bay, and that's where we start hitting outside. Nice. Yeah. Nice, man. 
Well, I'm like definitely gonna hit up like my family in Arizona. But, like you guys gotta go check them out. You gotta hit yeah. it up, man. I just be like, guys, go. Like yeah. I, don't, I don't, I don't talk to you that much, and you guys hate my guts. But go check out Nicholas' stuff. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say like, yeah, like Arizona is like California Canadians. Like it's kind of a yeah. weird situation. It is. Yeah. Uh, but you know what, dude. I think they hate us because we got the nice beaches. I think everybody hates Southern California. I, no, they do. Yeah, yeah. I, I dig it. Yeah, but you know what, man? I can't even hear him. It just feels so. Yeah. It's just so beautiful. I don't even know. Right. Well, I always laugh when you see like the East Coast in the winter time, like oh, 15 feet of snow, and somebody's shoveling. I'm like, 70 degrees out with the cool wind chill. Like, oh, I love it. It's, it's amazing. amazing. Yeah, best yeah. beaches. When I saw you went to the Texas beach. I don't even know Texas. Had oh beaches. no, New Jersey beaches are amazing. Have you been to them? No, I I've only been out to the East Coast once when I was young. Mm -hmm. I, I want to hit it up. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be worth it. Yeah, that's why you should go to Southern California. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. Well, you know what? I grew up as a punker. Like, no, that punkers. makes sense. And so like, Ramon sung about Rockaway Beach. That's all the, only, the only beach I want to go to is Rockaway Beach. Yeah, I mean, slithered. You have to be yeah. slithered. Really? Yeah, Coney uh, Island. I heard is dope. Is it? I. That's cool, but the Ramones didn't sing about Coney Island. They just sang about Rockaway Beach. Yeah, man, you uh, want to be sedated. Right? Yeah, so uh, I dig it. I dig it. Yeah. I dig it. <laughs> um, real quick, but I kind of just want to get into it with you. Is You said your daughter was your main inspiration. Yeah, my daughter is the reason why I'm even doing this. Um, it was funny. I even realized yesterday, I was like, I did uh, clothing for 15 years. Mm -hmm. And that was with stores, with designing for... Uh, from Young Money to with Chris Brown to Pepsi to blah, 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 blah. But that's gone, and I'm sick mm. of that. But I did that for my mom, and it was beautiful. I thought about it. I was like, I did that all for my mom. She's just my... She never looks bad. She's just always yeah. amazing. And uh, from <laughs> from picking cotton to a, to a flight, to a flight attendant as a panther, she's just my yes. mom. You know what I mean? That's so I awesome. did a lot for her. But this time around, when it comes to... Um, the art I'm doing it for my dad. My dad told me when I was five, six years old, true story, I said, Cub Hope, like after kindergarten, first grade, mm -hmm. get straight into chonies, and I'm jumping in the backyard. My dad's a dog breeder. Okay. And I'm jumping on the dogs all day. Da -da -da -da. And I, you know, in my mind, I, I think about it now as a father now, like, what the hell? Am I not spending time with them? <laughs> What's wrong with that? You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I would definitely, and uh, one day he asked, I was like, yeah, I got for it. She's like, you know, I'll, I'll buy some pizza. Let's bring some yeah. friends over. And we never had pizza. This is right. back in the day when you never had pizza, like once a year. Okay. And you had to shut up when you had it. You know what I yeah. mean? <laughs> and uh, I was like, all right, all right. So I told my friend, Giovanni, I'm putting you on blast right now. Oh. I told Giovanni a week before, man, like, hey, man, you want to come? He's like, yeah, I want to come. Long story short, he flaked on me on the bus. Oh. A week, so I'm crying on the bus. I'm uh. devastated. I come over to my dad. My dad's a G. He was like, man, fuck Giovanni. He's a five-year-old kid, too. <laughs> He's like, fuck it. I'm like, yeah, I understand. Yeah. After I'm done eating like, the pizza, I go back to drawing. My, my yeah. basic thing. He was like, you know what, Nick? Honestly, stick with this. So because these are your friends. Yeah. Regardless in life, you're going to have humans are going to make decisions. He's always talked to me like that. Yeah. And uh, he told me straight up, he's just like, stick with it. And I think back on all my life now from homelessness, divorces, leaving business, jail. Da -da -da -da. I've just lived amazing life. Travel yeah. the world, list goes on. That the only thing that I, at the end of the day that I have, even starting Sobel Commando, was me being homeless with this, like a Bible and a pad. Yeah. My best friends. No matter what, that's his face regardless. If I draw yeah. a happy face, that's going to be happy regardless wherever I go. Right. And that's like beautiful. And ever since then, i just been, I want my daughter to see that. I want my daughter to understand there's a world. Like Walt Disney will see it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. That's, wow, that's like really. That's the truth though. That's, yeah. that's where it all comes from. That's awesome, man. That's yeah. cool that you want to show your daughter. Like, I want my daughter, yeah, yeah. Especially when you get indoctrinated, indoctrinated in the system. You got to know that like, no, you can actually do what you want to do. And make <laughs> yaper with no ceilings. And you don't have to listen yeah. to. Damn near a slave master talking to you. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. The truth of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't mean the camera guy. We're we're kind of in that stage where we're like, you guys are doing. We we, we yeah, and we're doing it because, I mean, he took me out one day. He's like, yo, bro, I know I see you're sad. I mean, true story. My mom died. Yes, yeah, right. I was 
devastated, not doing anything. He's like, come on, dude, we gotta go do something. So he took a camera, went down to a shop called Quest, you know, and then now we're here. And that's I, the truth. I, if I thank him for doing that, because if not, I would never met like you, never met like half of the people we know. And vice versa. Right, vice versa. If I wouldn't follow my actual path, yeah. the steps and the footsteps, yeah. I wouldn't have been here. Exactly. And you had signs of it before. Yeah. Because the fact that you actually doing the harvest towards it. Mm -hmm. And that's what I've been doing. And it pays off. God it rewards does. you. Yeah, it does. You know, it's simple. Just, just play your part. Yeah. Work and shut up. You know, and you get, keep on getting blessed. Yeah. yeah. Remember that, guys. Just do it. Just grind it out. Yeah. I mean, I mean, you do get those people that get, like, the overnight sensation. But that's one and like, who knows how many. Yeah, but we don't have rich uh, family members. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. You know, yeah. it's different. Yeah, it's different. You know, but I mean, as long as you grind it out, you're good. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean, though, man? But even I was talking to uh, my brother the other day, like, at this point in my life, I'm no longer grinding. Yeah. Because I feel, <laughs> we've grinded before. Yeah. I've been grinding before. And grinding is like when you guys are failing the whole time and being like, <sighs> It's all right, man. Because one day, man, we're we're gonna get it. Yeah. Like you know, we're pushing. We ain't got no gas money. The list goes on. I, I've I've already done too much trying to. and learned and bumped my head too much. So all I'm doing is soaring. I just get it yeah. now. Like oh, okay, okay. And you're doing the same exact yeah. thing. You bumped your head too oh, much. Oh, just way too many times. Been by yourself, failing like ah, I can't uh, turn it over. Right. Uh, that's grinding. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We've been there. Yeah, yeah. hungry stomachs. Oh, dude. It's a different time now. Yeah. Cry like why does nobody like me? Yeah, 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 yeah that's yeah. grinding. Yeah, that's that is grinding. That's grinding. Yeah, we're not you, grinding, man. Uh, we're we should, moving. We're enjoying it now. Yeah, yeah, we're smiling more. Exactly. Like oh, I'm cool, man. That's what's up. Yeah. That's grinding. I'm going gonna sleep happy now. Waking yeah. up happy. I'm not yeah. sleeping because I'm happy. Yeah. There's a difference. You know yeah, what I mean? There's, yeah. One? There's there's not sleeping because you're sad or depressed <laughs> or whatever. No. That was like half of my twenties. You know? like, that was my twenties. Yeah. That was I was Pinocchio my whole twenties. Yeah. Like Try I don't know, Dick. Like, like, uh, yeah, you should have gone Pinocchio. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, no, they're cool. Yeah. I did that so many times. Yeah, so, just yeah. lying to yourself. Oh, my yeah. gosh. But that tail, that donkey tail, I had yeah. to cut off. Oh, yeah. And yeah, once you get man. rid of it, it's good. It's a lot lighter. Yeah. It's a lot lighter. I did. I, I get what you're coming with on that one. Oh, man. I tried to talk to, I was talking, try to talk to girls or try to talk relationship, but they, it yeah. wasn't, they never really, <laughs> yeah. they never really got it. Wow. So I kind of switched it up. Yeah, dude. I mean, I mean, I, I showed you some of my drawings, and I, the two <laughs> crew knows me. I do draw like dirty stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And like nobody gets me for it. Like, yeah, I mean, yeah, the homie camera guy. Just stay yeah. where you're at. I know. It's kind of yeah. You're yeah, doing ca good. The, the camera cameraman got me from high school. He's all, hey, dude, fucking do it. The, yeah. It makes you laugh. Just do it's it. Going, it. My brother yeah. told me that a golden law. He was like, if you like it, somebody else will like it. Exactly. And you know what? To the truth, before that, I never got it. Yeah. Shout out to Dominic. But I remember he told me, uh, he told me that because I would ask, I would come up with something that I'd be excited about. But I would ask all my brothers, like, "Yo, dude, what do you think?" Yeah. Like, oh, that's cool. That's cool. But even that goes so far because they love you. Yeah. But he just kept it simple, like, "Yo, man, I dig it." But then, day, man, if you like it, somebody else will like it. And that just kind of opened the door on some, like, oh, okay, I'm going, yeah. I'm going in. Yeah. Because I like all my stuff. Yeah. Strongly. So yeah, oh, yeah. 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 And then, the, I mean, what we saw right here is really awesome. I, then, I no, do this a lot. Yeah. That's when I'm done <laughs> with a lot of my paintings. Um, so and it, it gives me magic. And I know we saw some of the stuff that she had hidden away, and that stuff's really awesome too. Dude. Thank you, brother. And like I said, dude, man, your stuff is just awesome. And I remember just going into that that. Pat show at a shop called Quest. I'm just seeing your your military jackets just hanging up. Oh. And I was just like, damn, those are awesome. Yeah, man. Yeah. And I mean, you got famous people buying your stuff. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I've had um, Matt Groney bought a bought a, uh, a jacket, the uh, the maker of the Simpsons. Yeah. But I mean, from like I said, I've the list of rappers or like it is astonishing. I'm trying to think off the top of my head, like Snoop Dogg. Um, too short, E40, Jay Z had a shirt, um, Dipset, um, yeah, Drake, all yeah. these. Guys. Like, yeah, I've, I've I've done clothing for these people before. Nice. Chris for a minute, Chris Brown, great guy. Okay. He's a great nice. guy. But uh, I think this time going around, it just feels a lot better because even if I'm doing clothing, it's like, oh man, cool, and you can get whatever. But this is art. It's kind of like a different kind of situation that at least I can 
feed my family. Mm -hmm. So it feels a lot better. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Do the that. people don't it. The people yeah. don't. Oh. It's not the stars no, yeah. that get it, me. It, it's, it's my people, you. You guys coming with me. I mean, like, you can, yeah, yeah I've yeah. always been mad. Yeah, dude. Oh, we'll wait till that passes. You know where we're at. Yeah. We're in these streets right now. Yeah. That, that was like, um, I can't even think of that TV show. What's that? The biker one was, uh, Chips? Uh, chi oh, not chips. I was like, <laughs> chips, yeah. What <laughs> chips was that? <laughs> the Erica Strata. No, it was it. Let's go. <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh, man. I would have watched Chip more if it was that. Really? Yeah. Like, they, were just... it, it, they were just like, <laughs> let's get the fuck out of here. Da, da. I'm like, damn, these guys are crazy. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's where it went off air. Dude. Yeah. I, oh, man. No, I was. I can't even think of the chips, so we're not to cut that one. But uh, <laughs> okay, yeah, whatever. We'll leave it in there. Straight up. I, I remember one time I saw uh, a motorcycle cop trying to come down some stairs. I, I think I was like 17. This guy was with me. Oh, we're we're, we're coming out of a concert, and like we're really with my little sister and her friend. And the cop comes down the stairs, like on on, his, on, on the motorcycle. On the motorcycle, just just doing a uh, was it the nose wheelie coming yeah, down? Yeah. yeah. And like I was like, that's kind of cool, but then I know he's kind of showing off to like my sister and this other girl. I'm like, at the same time, I'm like, I fucking hope he falls. <laughs> Did he fall? No, he didn't fall. He, he pulled it out. I give him a high. He deserves a clap. Yeah, he, he got a clap. Like, All right, that's cool. that's that's still a clap. Yeah. Like. Yeah, you could be mad too, like. Yeah, it was it was a mad. But he slow deserved clap. a clap. Yeah. That's a good one. Yeah, it was a good one. But in the back of my mind, I was like, I just want to see him fall. It's like a laugh. <laughs> I want to laugh. It's like nah. <laughs> I know the feeling. Yeah. Yeah. I understand it. But um, yeah, man. So like I said, man, your artwork's just effing amazing. Caught my eye the first time we're at that that patch show out in a shop called Quest. Thank you, man. And just yeah, dude. And people to Geek Crew, if he, if he's in your town, go see him. Uh, especially when you're doing live painting, it's Thank just you. it's cool to see that. Yeah, I, I know. Like I like seeing that. And I I got a couple pictures of you last time at, at Melrose. Cause I think it's kind of boring. Just yeah. to, like I mean, for me personally, this is my attention span. If I'm looking at clothing, or I'm looking at if I got look at art the whole time, it's just not enough energy. I'd be like, oh, that's cool. Yeah. Or oh, that's cool. But if I see somebody in action, I'm into it more. Mm -hmm. I need more to get my attention. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, it, it's it's awesome. Cause you know. Thank you, bro. Stop by, check you out for five minutes, walk around. Yeah, the exactly. Ride, and then you come back and like, oh, he's finished with it, or he added this to this. Exactly. It's, it's really nice. Yeah, you're and your vest and a lot of pins is nice too. Oh, dude, I, I try. Kicking ass, you're doing. I'm, I'm just all homies. That's all. Homies. It is. All the homies. Good. Gotta support, dude. Gotta support. Gotta support. Gotta support, man. Yeah. So, yeah. Go check them out. Yeah. All over the U.S. Going to be all over the world. Uh, before I leave you, where can we see your stuff online? Uh, NicholasMayfield.com is pretty much is going to be up for the art show. Okay. We're redoing it, so it should be up now uh, by the eighth. And uh, you can get on Instagram. Mm -hmm. I would Mike Jones give my number, uh -huh. but that probably won't be a good look. <laughs> but what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my manager up right now because he'll right. give you the information. Boom. So. Your manager's awesome, dude. Every time he's I cool. see him, he's cool. He's all right. No, no, I no. Mean, he's, he's no, no. He's every, cool. Every time I see this guy, he has a smile on his face. He's uh -huh. happy to see us. Yeah, yeah. He's always asking us to take his photo. Yeah. Oh yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah that's yeah. me. Yeah, yeah. That's so Damon is just the greatest <laughs> manager ever. I'll give well, you thank that. Thank you, yeah. man. I, I appreciate it, man. And, I, and he didn't, he didn't pay me for this. Like, really? Yeah, I, I swear. He we, pays me to kick it with him. Really? Yeah, I swear. And I pay him, vice versa. I pay him. <laughs> so yeah um but real quick damon where can we find mr nicholas mayfield um well on instagram at, at mr nicholas mf mayfield we really want to go with uh because everything is moving so fast virally mm -hmm. so we really just want to have a like a viral commu uh consumer base mm -hmm. and then um the foot traffic from that virally just come out to our art shows and we'll post it all the time on his instagram you can look on my Instagram as well, Streets Likes, S T R H E A T Z, underscore likes, L I K E S. And um, yeah, like I said, we'll keep everything updated for you so you can always go back and um, get everything directly from us because this is a, the art is, is personal, if that makes any sense. It's personal. So he's giving a piece of his heart, you know, to you. So 
that's why we rather have it be based that way versus hey man yeah. just buy it man I don't know who you are yeah. everybody we kind of seem to have a personal relationship with such as you guys you guys are dope and awesome thank you I didn't pay him but yeah <laughs> other than that yeah this is this is oh, and real quick mm -hmm. when you guys have like the flyers and everything for wherever you're stopping at send them our way we'll repost them Damn uh, Dilly. Cool. yeah because I mean you just been so awesome to us since Thank day you, one. I appreciate that. Yeah, man. And, and vice versa, yeah, man. Yeah, I mean, we got to help each other out. Exactly. Right, That's right. Teamwork makes the dream work, man. Right. And, and like you said, we're just trying to get our cult following. Yeah. Right. That's all we care about is the cult. When we say a cult following, we're really just saying it's not such thing as fans. It's more so family. So everybody that has a piece, that's a that's person is a piece of us. As you can see, I wear it everywhere I go. Yeah. My shoes, my hat, you know, my sweats are from somewhere else, but... <laughs> That's cool. There'll be Nicholas Mayfield in 10 minutes, I'm sure. But, um, yeah, so, like I said, we'd rather have a, a family base. And then everything, the, co the coolest part about it is art. And as art grows, it appreciates. So even if you have a shirt, your shirt will appreciate. You know what I mean? And that's the first time within what you, what you want to call fashion or anything, that anything that you purchase that you can actually wear appreciates you know what i mean it's not hype beastie it's more so like it's it's really done out of love it's really art mm -hmm. so yeah it's really it's real yeah it's real it's actual people that are actually there uh people that are part of the culture uh people that still have gang banging friends and drug dealers people that are really skateboarding still mm -hmm. with the marks on their hands to prove it People that are the real, the, the culture. So it isn't hype beast. Right. Yeah. This isn't a place where you can buy the culture. Right. We don't want you, buddy. Right. What we want are the people that are real with the culture, the truths. That's right. it. We don't need that extra money. Keep that fake with the other brands. Straight up. Nice. I felt like I was picking. <laughs> <laughs> we try to be all in the videos. <laughs> all in the music videos. If you want the real cut of Nick Mayfield, yeah. <laughs> I should be the I should be the Shug Knight on that. He should be more so the Tupac in that situation. But I, you know, I was, I'll be the Tupac right now and just stay back. You know what I mean? Because they was like the Judas, you know, that they was to Jesus, <laughs> taking away the culture and all of that. I'll Straight be, up, I'll yeah. be uh, right now for that. Yeah, we're, we're we're by far against that. Right. So. Yeah. Yeah, man. Ah, uh, dude, that's crazy. Do you want to see bro. some more art or? Yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll do, uh, take what? some shots of art after yeah, this. We'll, yeah, we'll take some shots and we'll put it into the video. But real quick, I gotta ask. So oh yeah, A Gallery again. I'm sorry, oh, A Gallery. A Gallery. Yeah, uh, October Santa Barbara. 5th through um, the 8th. But you said cult, and I want to know: Do you have like names for your cult? Like you have like, uh, was it Slipknot calls their fans like the maggots because of the way they yeah. are? Yeah. You got. We gotta have like. I'm just call. I'm just call calling them family. Okay. That's I, want the them, best. I want them to keep who they are. Uh -huh. Nobody's a maggot. It's not going to be the Mayfields. Like, yeah, oh, yeah. Mayfields. yeah, that Mayfields. Wrong Mayfields. If anything, they'll probably be the heathens. The yeah. heathens. The heathens. I'll give you the that, heathens. That, they'll you probably go. be the heathens. Yeah, they'll probably be heathens. You know, we'll, let, we'll let them come up with whatever they want. Seriously, I, man. Yeah. We, we just love you for giving a fuck. Right. Yeah. We call it the gaff effect. Yeah. That's all that matters is the gaff effect. Like, yo, even if you buy it or you don't buy it, whatever, I don't uh, give a shit. It just do you give a fuck. And if you give a fuck, then thank you. Uh, That's all I care about. I mean, a lot of people don't know this, but when day one, when many of him were talking about, like, we're doing this, we're doing two key crew, we're, we said only two criteria they got to be cool, yeah. you got to give a fuck about them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, dude, you guys hit that, like, day Thank one. Thank you, brother. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. So, I'm going to end this with high fives and hugs. Thank you, brother. All right, man. All right. Your, your Instagram. But, okay. Oh, oh uh, yeah. David. And my Instagram. Instagram is Streets Likes. Uh, S T R. H E A T Z underscore L I K E S. Just hit me there. You can get all the information you need. If not, then like I said, I gave you Nicholas's. All right. Can I give a shout out for Yeah, dude. Shout out. Who do you shout want? out to uh, my amazing daughter, the reason why I'm still even living. Uh, thank you, Addis Rose, for everything. And daddy's kicking ass. And I got more for you. Mm -hmm. So, Tiki Crew, check out Mr. Nicholas Mayfield. Hitting in the U.S., taking over the world. You guys, peace out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you.